Is the recognized leader of the only uh, of, of, of the only uh, powerful uh, Russian opposition? What can you say? Uh, how can Americans and the rest of the world? I appreciate the true differences between your platform and Putin's government, not only within Russia, but also outside uh, Russia, how uh, Russia positions itself to the rest of the world in terms of China, uh, its uh, neighbors around Russia and uh, other countries. Well, first of all, the uh, problem of democracy and development of my country is our responsibility, not American. Americans can help to uh, Russia can help if they do not implement sanctions against the country but implement sanctions against people who break constitution and who break uh, human rights in the country like for example Mr. Surkov uh, did and does it will be helpful but to believe that American president and American administration will establish democracy in Russia means to be naive and it's, a, it's absolutely unrealistic and I don't think so. Uh, you mentioned about the, uh, uh, the only one candidate that will be uh, selected from the opposition movement when you will organize the Congress in, in December. Um, and we remember that uh, Mr. Kasparov mentioned that um, uh, when you have many uh, small oppositions, it's not good for democracy because it's not effective. But also when you have only one unified opposition, it's only one opinion. What do you think? Where can we draw the balance between uh, that in terms of uh, build the well, true democracy? The problem, problem of opposition is uh, dispersion. And uh, if you have 10 small groups, you can't do nothing and can't win. And it's impossible to explain voters what is the difference between one candidate and another. That's why nomination of the United Candidate is what we have to do. Our aim, uh, main uh, opponent is uh, existing corrupted power. That's why to have the one candidate and to have one platform is, is a real chance to show uh, society that uh, we uh, suggest better alternative than Putin wants uh, to suggest Russian people. That's why the only chance is to nominate one. Well, if we will win, maybe in the future it will be competition inside democratic camp. Uh, but this is not near future. This is, I believe, very long-term pro project and prospective. A few years ago, you mentioned in the Harvard Review that uh, you oppose the uh, governor's true autonomy. And uh, what do you think right now? How? What is the relation between Putin and governor? Some of the distant regions, and and are there any star? Uh, regional um, opposition leaders that can emerge, that can be useful for your movement also? Governors uh, are not uh, elected anymore. All of the governors uh, uh, I appointed, that's why uh, they have no independent uh, responsibilities, they have no independent political views. All of them are a member of Putin party and the governors uh, Comparing with what's happened in the end of the 90s, governors mean nothing. That's why relationship is like a relationship between boss and small uh, partner. That's it. This is not a problem now for Putin. He built very primitive system, but very inefficient.